Montgomery County police were led to the Bishop home this morning when concerned neighbors reported the family missing. Police searched the house on Lily Stone Drive near Potomac, conferred with North Carolina, and tonight confirmed. This is where the murders took place sometime after 6.30 on the night of March 1st. We have evidence of blood in the three bedrooms upstairs and blood in the master bedroom downstairs. We also have evidence that uh, the homicide of these five people took place at this residence as we have blood that leads from the home out to where the parking lot is. This is where we stand right now. We have investigators going to North Carolina. They're en route now to coordinate the efforts of our department with the uh, North Carolina uh, law enforcement people. What about Mr. Bishop? Mr. Bishop, at this time, we don't know where Mr. Bishop is. He's missing. So is a 1974 Chevrolet that belongs to the family. Teletype has been sent from Montgomery County, all points, and reference to the station wagon to try and locate the station wagon. Is he a suspect? We have no suspects in the crime at this time. There was no sign of a struggle, no sign of forced entry into the home. Evidence from North Carolina indicates the family was beaten to death. The children may have been in their pajamas at the time. The bishops moved here from California two years ago, described by neighbors as a close family. It was the Beckelmans next door who first called the police. I haven't told anybody uh, where they were going, and they, uh, uh, people miss them, you know. They uh, they're going to play tennis, so they're going to uh, share uh, uh, the groceries, or the children weren't at the school. They were like, oh, they're very fine people. Uh, the fellow was uh, with the State Department. Very, very fine people. The case has now been turned over to Montgomery County Police exclusively, taken out of the hands of North Carolina. Investigators will remain in the house probably throughout the night, searching for further evidence. Once again, police want to talk to Mr. Bishop, but again, they have not named him or anyone else as a suspect. This is Steve Gendell, Eyewitness News, Bethesda, Maryland.